I am going to use these guys to turn this into this. Let's start with the basics. I've got a two foot by five foot by two foot bin filled with dead leaves and yard debris. Composting worms will turn that into fantastic fertilizer provided they're alive, healthy, and happy. So how do you do that? It starts by preparing the bin. Worms like a moist environment, so I'm gonna start by dousing this in a little bit of water to make sure it's not completely bone dry. It's also important that you keep your bin between 40 and 84 degrees. Now I'm here in Tucson where it can hit 110 in the summer and below freezing in the winter. So I've placed my bin on the north side of my house where you can see it's still getting shade here at two in the afternoon. Since this box is made out of metal, which can get hot in the sunlight and conduct heat into the soil, I've lined the entire box with one inch wood boards for insulation. I've also added this vented lid you can see the air flows out the back here to provide some protection from both the elements and the local wildlife. Once you've got the bin prepared, it's time to put the worms in their new home. And this part is super easy because you're just going to dump them all right in the center of the bin. Do not, do not spread them out. They like to live in colonies and they will venture out on their own. Now it's time to give them a bit more food. In this case, I've got some ground up eggshells along with some various vegetables and scraps that we had. And now I'm going to cover them with some newspaper that I'm going to wet. This will keep them both moist and it'll keep it dark, both of which they like. And it'll give them some food, since they can eat the newspaper. And that's it. Now we just close the lid and let them get to work. So I'll be doing updates on this colony as it grows. So subscribe to the channel and you can learn how to do this right along with me.